The 7 Biggest Essential Oil Mistakes to Avoid Essential oils have been used for thousands of years, and their popularity is only growing. They are powerful natural compounds that can be used for a variety of purposes, including aromatherapy, skin care, and even cleaning. While they can be incredibly effective when used properly, they must be handled with caution. In this video, we talk about the biggest mistakes people make with essential oils and how to avoid them. Number 1. Disregarding Quality When shopping for essential oils, you may be tempted to choose the least expensive option. After all, they all contain the same basic ingredients, right? Well, not quite. The quality of your oils can have an impact on their effectiveness and potency. To get the most out of essential oils, you need quality products. First, you want to make sure that the company you're buying from is reputable and trustworthy. Second, the essential oils should be pure. Look for certified organic or wild-crafted oils that contain no synthetic ingredients, contaminants, or fillers that can reduce their effectiveness. Number 2. Failing to Dilute when it comes to using essential oils, applying them directly to the skin is one of the biggest mistakes people make. Essential oils can be highly concentrated and can cause skin irritation and other adverse reactions. To err on the side of caution, it's best to mix your oils with a carrier oil before applying them to your skin. Coconut, almond, and olive oil are great options. If you have sensitive skin, it's also important to avoid using any essential oils that are known to be hot, such as cinnamon, oregano, peppermint, wintergreen, or ginger. Number 3. Assuming that all essential oils can be ingested If you're new to essential oils, you may be tempted to use them internally as well as topically. But before you do, familiarize yourself with the dangers and potential side effects. Essential oils are extremely potent and can cause serious harm. While some essential oils can be ingested, others can be especially toxic and should never be swallowed, like tea tree, eucalyptus, and wintergreen. If you want to use an essential oil internally, make sure that it is safe for internal use and follow the recommended dosage carefully. Number 4. Using photosensitive oils in the sun did you know that some essential oils are photosensitive? Oils like lemon, lime, orange, bergamot, grapefruit, and cumin contain compounds that react negatively with UV rays. If your skin is exposed to direct sunlight while you're wearing an essential oil blend containing photosensitive oils, it can cause a burn on your skin. Ouch! So it's best to avoid using these oils if you're planning on spending the day in the sun. Number 5. Using Too Much For many people, essential oils are their go-to for everything, from cleaning to relaxation. But as with most things in life, too much of a good thing can be bad. Overdoing it with these oils can lead to serious adverse effects, such as nausea or vomiting. Plus, some oils are more potent than others, so it's important to learn about the properties of each oil before using it. Always start small and work your way up slowly when experimenting with new blends or trying out new techniques. Additionally, essential oils are generally not recommended for long-term use due to their high concentration of active ingredients. Number 6. Not storing them properly Essential oils are volatile and can easily evaporate, especially when exposed to heat and light. This can lead to oxidation and other chemical changes in the oil, altering its scent and medicinal properties. To avoid this problem, store your oils in a cool, dark place. Also, never use plastic containers for storing essential oils. Dark glass or ceramic is the best option. And remember to close the cap tightly after each use. Number 7. Ignoring Safety Risks while the use of essential oils can be beneficial to many people, it is important to remember that they are not safe for everyone. Essential oils can be toxic to children and pets, as their bodies may not be able to process and metabolize the oils. Pregnant women should also avoid essential oils, particularly during the first trimester. 
After that, some essential oils can be used with caution. Also, people with certain health conditions, like high blood pressure, or those taking medications, like blood thinners, must refrain from using certain essential oils altogether. When it comes to essential oils, there are a lot of things that can go wrong. From not using the right type of oil, to using too much for too long. It's important to know how to avoid these common mistakes, so that you can keep yourself and your family safe and healthy. If you are considering using essential oils, consult with your healthcare provider first. They can advise you on which oils are safe for you to use and the best ways to use them. Thanks for watching! If you thought this video offered some useful information, give it a like and share it with your friends. It allows us to create more great content. If you want to see more videos from us, hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss a post.